Over time, as breathing muscles weaken, people with Duchenne muscular dystrophy may lose the ability to cough effectively. <laughs> cough strength is measured with maximal inspiratory pressure, or MIP, maximal expiratory pressure, or MEP, and peak cough flow tests. If your MEP or peak cough flow measurements begin to fall, it may mean that your cough is too weak to clear mucus from your airway and you may need assistance. Not being able to clear your airway increases your chance of pneumonia. Talk to your neuromuscular specialist and or your pulmonologist about ways to assist your cough and keep your airway clear. Prevent pneumonias and keep the lungs healthy. Your pulmonology team may make recommendations to help your cough. One, taking breaths one on top of the other without breathing out until the lungs are completely full is known as breath stacking. Breath stacking will help keep your chest wall and abdominal muscles strong and flexible, allowing you to have a strong exhalation or breathing out. A strong exhalation will help you to clear mucus from your airway. Breath stacking can also be assisted by using a self-inflating bag and mask or ventilator. Two, a manually assisted cough. Manually compressing the upper abdomen or chest wall as the patient coughs or exhales strongly can help to improve mucus clearing. Manually assisting a cough should be done somewhat forcefully, but should never hurt. Please do not do this until your pulmonology team shows you how to do it safely. 3. A combination of deep breathing in and forceful breathing out can be done by combining techniques 1 and 2, or by providing a mechanically assisted cough, sometimes called a cough assist machine. This machine provides a positive pressure that pushes air in, followed by negative pressure that pulls air out. This can be done using a mouthpiece, face mask, or a breathing tube. A mechanically assisted cough can be used to help patients who are breathing without assistance or those using non-invasive ventilation. Keeping your airway clear is very important. Following the recommendations from your pulmonary team will help keep you healthy.